hey girl welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys my nighttime routine if you're new here my name is shakenya so um yeah welcome girl um if you have not yet make sure to hit that subscribe button give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment below also don't forget to turn on your post notifications so um i'm just gonna basically show y'all my nights my current nighttime routine my skin is acne prone um, combination skin usually very dry during the colder months of the year and in the warmer months super duper oily either way i have oily skin but um yeah it tends to get really really dry during the colder months of the year first thing i'm going to do is go on with my cleanser from verse um i like to double cleanse so yeah this is the first thing that i like to use um i'm actually going to triple cleanse tonight because i really um I want to just use my acne, uh, what is that called? My acne cleanser because, girl, we got to keep these pimples under control because if not, it's a mess. It's a whole mess. So, as you can see, I'm just rubbing that into my face. Also, on my eyes, I usually don't put it on my eyes because it has eucalyptus, but I did tonight. Um, now, I'm taking my Clean Skin Club towels, and these are a game changer, a big game changer because I was using these if, um, the first time I got them. I was using them to just dry my face after washing my face, but then I started like really doing my research on them and seeing other ways that I could use them, and I found out that I could use them to like remove my makeup, wash my face, stuff like that. So I'm just showing y'all the front of the cloth because it has like these like small squares on them. That's like basically the exfoliating side. And then the other side is flat. I just literally rinsed this off of water and all of the makeup came from one off of it, which never happens. Like when you have a, you know, if you have a washcloth or even your beauty blenders, it's very hard to get makeup out of them. But this, like the makeup came right off. After that, I'm just going to use my micellar water and just get the rest of that stuff over my eyes. And then I'm going to my first, um, like soapy cleanser, which is from Youth to the People. And after that, I'm going to go on my Penoxyl. Um, Penoxyl, the Penoxyl that I'm using is 10%. I'm going a little bit ahead of the video because, girl, it was just a lot going on. But, yeah, um, I am going to use the 10% Panoxu. I usually use 4%, but I ended up ordering the 10% by mistake. But um, I just make sure not to put it in the areas where my skin is really sensitive, like on my eyelids and, like, in the corners of my eyes, and I'm okay. I, I usually don't get any burns when I just keep it on the outside, the outer parts of my face. So, again, I used a towel. I rinsed it. Just wanted to show you how strong it is. Like, these things are no joke. Now, I'm just drying my skin with a regular paper towel because, girl, I did not want to use up um, my, any more of my towels for the night. Now, I'm using my Dennis Gross uh, face pill. While I let that first one sit in on my face, I'm going to take my Oli vitamins. And the fact that I'm this greedy and I'm enjoying these gummies this much is really insane. Because not me dancing. But they are really good. Next, I just wanted to show you how the Dermalogica Daily Exfoliant. Not going to use this tonight because I used the peel already on my skin. But I want to show y'all um, what I use. Because I like to alternate my products. Um, so if I use like something that's really harsh, I usually won't use like um, another exfoliant. I use one exfoliant a night. I don't use two. Um, now I'm just going in with my second peel well the second pad from the peel and then after that i sprayed my face with the tower 28 sos spray letting that dry and sink into my skin showing you guys the dermalogica power bright overnight cream which really really transformed my skin like this is what really changed everything for me after i ran out of the first serum that came with the in that bundle i started to use my faded cream and now I'm just going to moisturize my lips with the Summer Fridays um, lip balm. But yeah, I'm going in with the Dermalogica tonight. Not using Faded. Tomorrow I'll use Faded. Um, now I'm using my Shawnee Darden Retinol. And just pressing that into my skin. And also making sure to not pull my skin down but lift it up. And after that, then I'm just going to... I'm adding my moisturizer from the pharmacy. And I think it's called Honey Halo or Halo Honey. One of those two. Now I'm using my Ilia Eye Cream. Just to be honest with y'all, I don't use this every night. I'm just using it tonight because I just was like, why not? Um, now I'm drinking my water because that's been keeping my skin clean and clear as well. And now I just wanted to zoom in and show y'all what my skin is looking like. So I still have a lot of work to do with my skin. Um, working on my texture and really just getting rid of that hyperpigmentation. But yeah, my skin looks really, really good. I was able to get my skin to this level of... <laughs> clarity 
if I I guess that's the way the best way I could explain it. I was able to get my skin that way though from um first starting with the Dermalogica like it was the three step um what is that called? It's like a three step routine. It has SPF, the Power Bright Overnight Cream and then the Power Bright Serum for in the daytime and you make sure that you wear the SPF with that. Once I was finished with the daytime one, that's when I moved on to my faded and also the Panoxyl because I feel like the Panoxyl really keeps like my acne under control like i'm gonna be honest with you i don't think that there's anything else that i've used that's worked as good as the panoxyl wash and then the um dermalogica for the hyperpigmentation so yeah that's it i hope that you guys enjoyed and i will see you in the next one